Adding photos to videos is a great way to add visual interest and personalize your videos. In this tutorial, I'll show you how to add a photo to a video using the InShot app. You can use this technique to add photos to any type of video, whether it's a travel vlog, a home movie, or a video for your social media. To get started, first open up your InShot app and then tap on video. I'm going to pick something random for the sake of this video. And then if you want to add a photo to this video, you have two different options. So the first one is to tap on this plus icon at the bottom left of the screen and then tap on video slash photo. After that, tap on photo and you can select any photo that you like from your gallery and then tap on this check mark at the bottom right. And that photo will be added to your timeline. So you can move the position of this photo by tapping and holding it, and then drag that image to the front of the video or behind it. So let's play it and see how it looks. And as you can see, it plays the video, and then it moves to the photo that I added. So, you can tap on this and add transitions. Let's swipe through these and see how each transition looks. So you can choose any basic transition for your videos, but for other transitions you have to get InShot Pro. Once you find a transition that you like, tap on the check mark on the right side of the screen. You can swipe through these options and you can flip it, and you can play around and do all the other stuff with this too. So the second way to add a photo to your video is by tapping on the sticker option over here, then tap on sticker once again, tap on this image icon over here, and then tap on import. So now you can import a photo to your timeline from the gallery. As you can see, it adds that photo to the top of your video. So you can tap and hold on this and move it around to anywhere that you like on the timeline. You can tap on it and then drag it to make the photo bigger. And you can drag these edges over here to make it shorter or longer. And you can also play around with this photo too. After that, Tap on this check mark over here to add this photo to your video. So that wraps up this video. If you have any questions about this whole process, please let me know in the comments section below.